Welcome you all. My name's Mike Tyrrell. I'm the Chief Executive. Uh, and a uh, nice little turnout we've got uh, to uh, see James open uh, our outdoor gym today. Uh, very, thanks very much for uh, our colleagues from Oakland. I can see Patrice, the head teacher there. And uh, all the class are in a proper PE lesson. Yeah. <laughs> but they want their fish and chips first. <laughs> That's what I've been told. Um, uh, the outdoor gym is uh, part of uh, our plan, part of our corporate plan, where one of the commitments that uh, we've got as a housing association is to uh, help work with uh, the local health authority on improving the uh, uh, life expectations and health in general in Tower Hamlets. I was uh, uh, telling James earlier, uh, in Tower Hamlets, 13% of children starting primary school are obese. By the time they're leaving primary school and going to uh, secondary school at Oakland, it's 25%. Now, as someone who was very, very obese myself until very recently, I, I've got no <laughs> excuses, but you can see as part of the commitment that THCH have got to, 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 to this outdoor gym. We're going to be piloting this outdoor gym. If it works here over the next year, uh, our residency chamber have asked for one. Pat's asked for one right outside her place in Tarling. <laughs> we expect you to be there, Pat, should we get the funding for that. So, firstly, uh, I've got to thank uh, Sport England for funding this. We've never been doing it without uh, uh, Sport England. I'm absolutely delighted. Uh, uh, to do that, and to, especially the fact this park's just been renamed the Cameron Best Park after our former colleague uh, Cameron. I'm really pleased to see some of these family here today. It's, it's lovely. Uh, to got thank Shamim and the team, the community development team, for uh, uh, the work they've done in uh, uh, getting the funding and uh, uh, getting the gym up and running. And thank our residents from the Bethnal Green uh, Area Resident Board who have been uh, uh, spot on in, in helping us support us, getting the, the, the local residents to support this and uh, getting it in here. Uh, James is here today as a result of uh, uh, Dean from uh, Ollie Construction, uh, our general build uh, uh, repairs firm, who uh, uh, done a lot because we have residents who say we have too many politicians. <laughs> it's James pulling the string today. Um, and, um, uh, but uh, firstly, just want to introduce Roshanar Rally, our local MP. Uh, Roshanar is going to say a few words before I introduce James, and James is uh, going to uh, do the unveiling. Right, well, um, first of all, uh, it's great to be here, and I'm sorry that you're getting a politician. <laughs> so I'm James's warm-up act. <laughs> I'm, as you know, I'm your local member of Parliament, and I wanted to say, can, can we have, first of all, can we have the young people, or am I going to ruin your plan, towards the front? Please? Yeah, no. Can we have everyone towards the, the front? Since it's, since it's particularly for you guys and girls, um, why don't you come, come so you can hear us? And if we had all, we'll all stay warm as well. Um, come, come up. Um, and maybe when, 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 maybe when James is um, pulling the string, then we can have you all close by. Oh, yeah, we'll have a good fun. Yeah. Um, but I, I want to I want to echo what Mike has said, which is that uh, we need uh, play spaces, especially for young people, um, because of all the things he said. Uh, does it, who knows what obesity means? Okay, go on, you'll go. And extreme fat. Getting yes, getting big. Yes, that's right. Um, so, you know, it's when it when it causes health problems. So that's why a, a, a obesity is such a big problem. It can cause heart disease. It can cause all sorts of other problems. And that's why it's so serious, and that's why it's really important that everyone uh, keeps fit. Um, my mum goes to the gym more often than I do, so um, you know I'm getting my lessons from my mum. But she started later on in life when she started realising actually it's really um, important for her health. And so what's really important is that you can influence your mum and dad as much as they can influence you to do regular exercise and keep fit and healthy. And of course, uh, the other thing that um, lots of people will know about, but maybe maybe it's a new thing that I can, I can share with you, is if you do regular exercise, you are happier. Because when you do exercise, you release certain hormones, uh, happy hormones, um, that keep you cheerful. So um, that's another good reason to do regular exercise. And of course, this is a fantastic location to be able to do outdoor exercise. So I'm really looking forward to coming around here uh, and 
seeing you all in action and of course today as well it's been really great to see you um, using this space and using the facilities and I want to say a big thank you to T Town Hamlet Community Housing Association because um, this kind of work is so important and I want to say a big thank you to local residents uh, for coming here today and uh, a lot of familiar faces um, so really really nice to be here and I hope you enjoy uh, this great facility make sure you look after it because if you keep it clean and tidy and you look after it it's your playground and it's your gym so if you look after it then I'm sure Mike will want to uh, you know, create more of these gyms all over the borough. Uh, and but if he sees that it's not being used properly and it's not used enough, then he might not. So what are we going to do? What's our challenge? Are we going to make sure that we use it and we encourage all our friends to come and yes. use it as well? Yes. So that Mike can um, get the message and make sure that we get some more of these facilities all over the borough. How about that? How about that for a challenge then? Okay, brilliant. Well, thank you all for coming, and thank you very much for um, this facility, Mike. That's all right. Thank you, Roshan. So, uh, as I said, uh, Dean, Dean's arranged for us to uh, have, have James, and James's mum is very important in all this, because it's James's mum that uh, shamim has been talking to to arrange this in uh, James's uh, very, very busy diary. As we all know, he was the 2008 uh, Olympic middleweight champion at uh, the Olympics in Beijing and uh, absolutely delighted that uh, uh, he's able to uh, do this today, especially as uh, James Lake's fight was last Saturday. Uh, he's won uh, 17 so far of his 18 fights and we're uh, looking for a long career for him and we hope that uh, he'll be another name of a future as a London uh, world champion. Patrice, you get in there. Thank you. Wait for Sir. Sir, 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 do your hair. Make sure your hair. The closer your hoodle, the warmer your beard. Okay? Yeah, make sure to <laughs> 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 Right, this way. I'll do the little one in the back. Oh, 